What is up, everybody? Beer Soldier here in Terra Genesis, where you get to make your own world. Um, I'm very sorry I was not able to put a video out the other night. It was my birthday, so I had I was in the middle of doing some other stuff. Plus the moon. Let's go with this one since it's free. Let's go with Earth. Maybe. Can I have Earth? No. Oh, I have to unlock Earth. Let's go with Mercury then. Can I have Mercury? Name for the quick footed messenger of the classic Roman gods. The planet Mercury is heat blasted rock orbiting close, closer than any other sun with a mildly temperature cycle over 7,700 K. Mercury experiences greater temperatures, extremer extremes than any other bot body in the solar system. Interestingly, though, the planet spins so slowly that it would be possible to walk in twilight forever, keeping pace with the sunrise and the relatively m mild pre-dawn temperature. Uh, this one. Let's actually read these. After sundering, sundering the surviving nation of the world agreed to pool their resources. This one gives me government democracy, vows, knowledge, reduced cost of academy, eco policy, conservative, industrial, reduced cost of sky farm, ecological transformation. Cost of salinal values wealth per plutocracy reduces cost of orbital surveillance. Look at the rose. I'm a beginner. Tutorial enabled. Let's begin the game. Welcome to Terra Genesis. Welcome. You have embarked upon a awe-inspiring journey. The quest to colonize an entire planet, transforming it into a stable, habitable home for humanity. <laughs> the dreams and hopes of our entire species follow you into the stars. This is, is the main game screen. From here, you will be able to track your planet's progress and guide its evolution. To begin, tap the colonies button to establish your first settlement on this world. Okay. In this section, you'll find a list of your current colonies. From here, you will be able to manage and expand, expand your settlements all across the planet, even as you dramatically transform its surface. This also where you'll come to find entirely new colonies. Let's do that now. Tap Found New Colonies to choose a proper site for your next settlement. Adding a new colony will cost OC. Oh, Would you like to begin construction now? Confirm. New colony, your colony, colonists are ready to land, they just need a proper site. On this page you'll find a map on the planet is currently exists. Tap anywhere on the map to find a colony, and then provide it with a name suitable for its place in history. Be sure to keep one eye on the elevation map as well, as for transforma transforming efforts progress, the sea levels will, will likely begin to change and any colony submerged beneath the waves will be destroyed. The darker areas of the elevation map are lower and will be the first to fill with water. Oh, so I need to... What should we name it? Let's name it First Step. Well done. Your colonies of land are now beginning to make homes for themselves, transforming, transforming this small landing site into a full-fledged colony. However, 
will take a lot more than a few colonists. Let's be let's get some details about our new colony. Return to the colonist section, select the new settlement, and tap exam button. Colonies. Now, first step. Examine first step. Welcome to the first step. From here, you can manage your colony, taking it from a tiny interplanetal station to a home of millions of people. Colonies are among other things, the primary production facilities for your new world. Any terraforming efforts you make will be start will be started from within a colony. For now, let's build another hab unit so there's room for more colonists. Tap build new fa facility. Open the population section and begin the construction. Yeah, plants and transformers so others can only survive on the surface using self-contained airtight habitations. The habitation units you know, simplify the con compact structure that can support an early, early landing party or the beginnings of a new settlement. Build. Alright, construction has begun. Normally this would take a while, but let's, let's cut to the chase. You have a certain number of Genesis populations, Genesis points available to you. These allow you a number of advantages, including the ability to hurry production of a facility. Tap the new facility and choose Hurry Construction. So, did I do it? Very good. Before long, this colony will be a thriving city. As your terraforming efforts progress, you will add more facilities like that to move you towards your goals. But for now, your first requirement is income. We won't be able to get far without a few credits to spend. In addition, in addition to managing your colonies, this screen also lets you build and manage your outposts. Outposts are your primary source of income. From here, you'll be able to scan and mine for resources which will help you fund your co so, la la, colonization. Placing an outpost works just like placing a colony. Tap Found New Outpost and find a suitable location. When you're done, examine the new outpost and place your first mine. Is that here? Yeah, new outpost. One million seed, would you like to begin? How much seed do I have? Oh, I have enough. Colonies and outposts can't be built too close together. Choose a location for your outpost that isn't close to any other site. Okay, what should we name this one? Beer post. Since it's an outpost, make it a beer post. Ha ha ha. We detected a transmission from a ship en route to Mercury and cost a short video and we believe that viewing it will provide us with two free GP immediately. I, I can't. Okay, what's up with beer post? Examine beer post. Build a new mine. Oh, goody. What's this? Alright. <clears throat> You're ready to place your first mine. Use the direction controls to move the scanner and watch for a spike in the result on the left. When you found a significant deposit, focus your scanning scans using the slider on the right. When you tighten your scan all the way down, you will be able to tap Establish Mine and place your first mine. From there, this mine will produce credits for you automatically until the de depleted. Feel free to establish multiple mines in the area. To increase your revenue stream. When you're done, place a mine and return to the main menu. It's looking like right over there is about to be my best my best location in order to Establish because they got really, really high over there.
Construction. Constructing a carbon mine will cost 50 C. Are you sure you want to proceed? Confirm. Amazing. Research and culture. Welcome back. We're almost done, but there are, there are three more sections you need to learn about before you are ready to take over the colonization of this planet. Let's start with the research view. Tap the leftmost hex button to open a research. Research. Colonizing and tra terraforming are an entire an entire planet will require the development of entirely new industries, and those begin with researching new technologies. Here you'll find the list of technologies available for research in your labs, divided into the six zones of interest for your terraforming efforts. When you're finished examining the section, tap the planet icon to return to the main menu. I don't want that one. While floating cities still remain a dream from the future, we can now construct a large floating platform on which people can live and work for, work for extended periods of time. In addition to the productivity output of the facility built upon these, the floating platform would shade the lower atmosphere from the sun's rays, helping to cool the surface overall. Research that. How many Genesis more? Okay. Yeah. Immersion in the platform is right there to begin construction tap. Build a new facility in any colony with available space. Well, I did it. Oh shit, going too far. Reduce recent advances in compression and storage technology have opened the door for new possibilities. Pumping atmospheric gases and reservoirs compressing them and storing them underground. It's labor intensive and indulgent, but it works. But it would take off 4% of pressure. It's only going to take 15 minutes. No, I want that one. Fine. Okay, yeah, cool. I need oxygen. I'm going to spend up all my Genesis points. Ah. Don't I need all of this? Cloud Cedar? That's going to take two. No, that only takes one. Okay, I'm going to slow down. Where I spend all my stuff. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Culture. At first, our planet's culture will be determined entirely by the factions by who you choose colonize it. But as the population grows and planets develop in a history of its own, your culture will begin to grow and change. At certain population thresholds, you will earn culture points, which can be spent here in one of the five sections. Each gives you its own benefit and comes with two with its own penalties. So choose wisely. When you're done, return to the main menu and select Statistics page using the button on the top left. Okay, go back. What was it that I need to click on? I don't think it was that. Any new colonists will cost construction now. Confirm. Wait, I don't think this is it. You're currently in game using biomass and single material compression. 
Rather than buying mass, use a biosphere in your next game to set the biosphere in your new creation of next set your plan's orbit. Not available in beginner mode. Well, how do I do the thing that I just did? In order to begin construction, go to one of your colonies and select build new facility. Oh. So I did have to go to colonies. And it was... Wait, was it build new call? I, f I feel so stupid, I done forgot. Now. Build new facility. Build new facility. Build new facility. Colony. I don't have anything. First of Abaddon and Abaddon three. Ooh. Right. I don't think I did that wrong. Isn't this the one where I do the whole, uh, we'll leave this one the challenger. Isn't this where I make my mines? Oh, that was not my mines. Oh, that's not it. Ah, that's right. Confirm. Winner, winner on that spot. Damn. So is this basically what I do? My pop, my priority is to increase pressure. Cancel. I'm trying to scroll. Then I already do this. Go to one of your colonies. So I have to go to my colony. Human oxygen is a present in a planet's atmosphere. There are often still huge quantities of it available, hidden away in the more complex mo molecules on the surface of the atmosphere of gases such as carbon monoxide, dioxide, and gathering of these sources. We can begin to reintroduce it into the atmosphere. Four plus four oxygen. Is it just going to be black again? Is it just going to be dark? Whoa, that's my first one. I'm doing amazing. I think I'm doing amazing. I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea if I'm doing good or not. I, I think I'm doing fine. What, what am my statistics? Oh. Da -da -da -da. Transforming a planet is a very complicated and delicate operation. In this section, you will be able to track each of the zones in interest for your colonization efforts to make sure your efforts are on track to turn this planet into a paradise. This page is rich 
and resources, so examine it closely and get to know it well. When you're done, exit the page. Press X button on top right corner. Well, I'm surface water requires at least 600. Okay, I'm sorry. Insufficient pressure. My goal was 287. They're pulling in nothing. This is going to be a very time-based game, I'm assuming. Congratulations, you have now all the tools and knowledge you need to colonize and transform Mercury into the next step of human university. You have an entire world at your command. Govern it wisely, manage it delicately, and bring your vision of humanity future to life. Good luck. You're currently game user by Oh, I still don't have it, do I? Well, that's just lovely. 782. What did I need in order to build another... These. Oh. Three million, see. Huh. Okay. I don't have enough. So what am I supposed to do then? Because I can't do anything now. Do I just research stuff, apparently? Oh, shit. Cancel. Colonies? Examine. Does it not cost anything to mine? I don't understand. Am I doing right or am I doing bad? I, I don't... Wait for more of it. I don't understand. Am I messing up? The challenger is pulling in. Am I supposed to just build more and more mines every place I go? way I just that ain't the right way it must be somewhere around in there because up here doesn't even really get all that high How much C do I have? <clears throat> that, that must be what I have to do. I must be sitting here trying to build. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. This game is very, very confusing. It's not really confusing, it's just I don't understand. Ooh, I had a spike. Ooh, right there. You're gonna cost 150. Uh, so okay, so I'm trying to get these guys to bring in as much C as possible. That uh, makes sense now. <laughs> Cause at first, oh, okay, I thought my game froze. But I say, well, guys, we're done. No, give me that high one back. Right there. Ooh, yeah, 200 C. Ah, worth it. Okay, now that one's bringing in 2,000 per minute. <laughs> okay, let me see here. Your beer post is bringing in 2,000 per minute. Challenger's bringing in that. I need to get him another mine out. 
because he had some really good spots earlier. Oh, oh, look at that. Bring it. I'll try to build in one more mine. Laser down my focus. Come on, give me a sweet spot. Give me a sweet spot. There we go. Oh, go back. Oh, they were just that. I must have went too far over. Come on now. There's got to be another sweet spot somewhere around here. Oh shit, you're going really high there for a second there, buddy. Try to find me another sweet spot. Somewhere that's gonna really bring in some goods. Since I'm so laser focused in right now, I can't skip over anything. Because the minute I do is where I'll miss a real good sweet spot. Now it's just finding the really good sweet spots. There's another one that was right over here somewhere. That went up. Establish. Yeah, that one cost me a genesis point. Six kilometers above sea level. <laughs> Alright, I think that's about all I can really do here. I mean... Unless there's something in here I can do. I don't get my next point until I reach 250 population, and I can't reach a 250 population. Because just to make a new colony, I have to have 5,000 C. Okay. First step population begin. It's got a minute. That's got 44 seconds. Confirm. The first step is going to plant has been construction. Confirm. Oh, I don't have that. Okay. <laughs> Minus four on the pressure and plus four oxygen. Wait, can I upgrade these? What happened? Colonies. First step, examine first step. Okay, I can. Next facility. Right. Pop. So, are these guys just gonna slowly start making babies or something? I'm assuming that's what's going on here. I don't know. Um, so thank you guys for watching. I'm going to end the video here, and I will make another video about it at a later time. And once again, like I said, I wasn't able to get a video out the other night. It was actually my birthday, so I was actually very busy. Um, so thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Let's see how far we can get this planet to go. Hopefully I don't kill everybody. So thank you all for watching. Catch you next time.